My name is Dr. William Tatum. I'm director of the Comprehensive Epilepsy Program at the Mayo Clinic in Jacksonville, Florida, and professor in the Department of Neurology. Our article that is going to be published in the Mayo Clinic Proceedings is entitled Oncoepilepsy, More Than Tumor and Seizures. The takeaway message of the article is that both brain cancer and epilepsy have shared pathways that may be able to combine to help our patients by treating both diseases with a single approach. With extensive research that's been done on both patients with primary brain tumors or glioma and those with epilepsy is that the pathways that involve both conditions involve both molecules such as glutamate and connectivity pathways through electrophysiology seen by various testings in both condition to suggest that despite a single focus, both have widespread disease and therefore ramifications on psychosocial, economic, and neurocognitive influences. Mayo Clinic is a very unique institution in the sense that neurosurgery, neuro-oncology, and neurology work in a teamed approach to try to answer questions as to how we can better provide for our patients that have two conditions, both being disabling, giving them only one treatment. The clinical practice involves both medication and surgical approaches such that tumor resection and medication may overlap to provide the most optimal medical surgical treatment uh, that can be offered today. What that means for patients is that by identifying emerging evidence that suggests that seizures stimulate tumor growth and tumors stimulate seizures, and by looking at the two together, that we can provide a unique opportunity for uh, both pharmaceutical development and dedicated surgical treatment to treat both conditions as a single condition as opposed to two separate conditions of brain tumor plus seizures. The next step for this research is to engage the pharmaceutical companies to promote further identification of underlying etiologies relative to outcome. And in the past, various anti-seizure medications that are useful for treating patients with epilepsy have been shown to extend survival in patients with brain cancer. We know that there's a common thread relative to the mechanisms that occur for both conditions. If we can somehow harness and focus and target that area by having ph pharmaceutical companies develop new agents, we can learn more about treating both conditions together than we can treating both conditions separately. We hope you found this presentation from the content of Mayo Clinic Proceedings valuable. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about us, our homepage is www.mayocliniceproceedings.org. There you will find access information for our social media content such as additional videos on our YouTube channel or journal updates on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter. More information about healthcare at Mayo Clinic is available at www.mayoclinic.org. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.